Hello guys and welcome back to another video. And today, and today I'm sorry I haven't been uploading, but but yeah, it's really early in the morning and I went to bed at like 12 o'clock. I was figuring out what video I was gonna do today because I haven't been on. But it's Thanksgiving week, so I'll probably get a lot of videos out. And my brother's in the background. Um, if he wants to, he can talk, but I prefer for him not to. And you can hear the fan. Is I'm cooling down the computer. I have this little hand fan, but I'm cooling down the computer. And in this video, we're gonna be showing you how to download Minecraft mods. I see I already have one out here because I took it out of the end game. But this one will be using Forge. Now, I don't know how to do the one using WinRAR, but I use WinRAR for getting games for free and stuff like that. Like I got, I got Terraria for free using WinRAR. So anyway, I'm going to show you how to do it. First of all, open any browser. I prefer Chrome because it has a downloader that works. And I'm just going to set that as default because my mom can change today. Now this is my computer, but I love, let her use it. So anyway, search up 1.8. It depends on what version of Forge you're using. 1.8 Forge. Forge mods. Now, I hope to get a lot of views. Now, I mean, you either go to Minecraft Forge, that's how you download Forge. So first of all, download Forge. So you go to it's Forge, Minecraft Forge.net, Forge Mod Loader for 1.8. So, guess what? First of all, to do this, you go to Downloads. Now, this can use some more... Anyway, it told me to go, oh my god, what the, alright, hold on, alright, then go here, so you're going to want to, so it's going to open the screen that looks like this, Minecraft versions, you click on 1.8, 1 1.8, 1 .8. and then, once you have done that, it's going to bring you to this page, this place, And then you're going to do installer for latest. Installer. Not installer win, just installer. Now, I've already downloaded Forge, but you click that, and I'm going to do it again just for you. Click on the installer, and then go to add focus. Um, blah, 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 blah. Hold on, guys, I'm going to switch over. But Um, hold on. Alright, I'm actually going to switch over to Mozilla because Mozilla, for some reason, runs a little bit faster. Not now. Anyway, search up for Forge. Forge. Oh my god. I get Forge. Done it. Files. Done. So you're going to want to click on Minecraft Forge. Now 1.8. 8.8. 1.8.8 bots, and then one, and then there's 1.8. Since I want a new Minecraft Forge installer, I'm just gonna say it, I'm going to do that. There we go. Hold on, go back, go back, go back. So you just click on 1.8, and then download recommended installer is what I would do. Now, it's going to bring you to your software, might be out of date, blah, blah, blah. Guess what? Don't listen to that. Skip. It's like an ad fly. Just click skip. Or it pops up. Forge is trying to hook us up with this. So, anyway. So, anyway. You wait. Anyway, I know my computer's really slow. Like, just skip. Let's get, but anyway, you Important do security that. message. Down. Please Three, call four, the number provided as four, soon as four, possible. You will be guided for the removal of oh the adware God. spyware virus on your computer. I don't Seeing these pop ups means that. No, those are sometimes really fit. I mean, they tried. They tried to fool me with that. Anyway, you bring out your forge out of your download file if you have the setting. Then double click on it. 
it's 1.8 installer because I didn't. I was just too lazy. 0.8, and then you click install client. Now, since I've already done this, I'm going to click cancel, and I'm just going to put that there. Anyway, once you have done that, open the game. Open your Minecraft launcher. Now, in this, you're going to see it's already on Minecraft. But if you need to get that, first of all, you can leave your profile same. PJ Hunter is my name. So you can leave it the same. And then you go down. So say you're up here, you're using 1.8.8. You go all the way down and click on your Forge file. Then save profile. And then exit out. Next, you're going to want to press the Windows key on your keyboard and press it with R. And then it'll open this. Type in app data. Or first, type in this. Percent app data percent. Once you've done that, click OK. And then find your dot .minecraft folder. Double click on it and it should have a mods folder and then that's where all you store all your mods. Now I'm going to switch a mod out because there's one mod that I really don't like and it's the singularity mod. I downloaded it a few weeks ago, I've been using it. But anyway, yeah my fan is going hot. Even though the computer isn't hot, it's just I don't know. I'm gonna close it as much as I can. But anyway, once you've done that you put your mod in this folder and then you can exit out and then open your minecraft again just but exit out of your launcher before you do this so just exit out real quick say so yeah, i exit out do it again open it up and wait until it loads then your forge file now if you want this to make sure it works do in the forge profile then you do this. You download it because it's that it's gonna download the mods. And then after that, soon after, it's going to open this screen. This screen is what you'll see. Now just wait just a second while it loads because it I put I took and put in a mod. Which sometimes makes it run a little bit slower than usual. So just gotta wait. Gotta wait. See, you should see this Minecraft 1.8. Now, in this box, you're going to either see this. Now, it's not going to respond because my Minecraft is really slow. As you can see in my last video. So, I ch this channel is going to be based on some of this. Essence of the Gods, Mr. Crayfish. Now, it should say all of these mods. Now, these are the ones I have. And my brother thought the webcam was on, so he just waved, but it's not. I don't. I, I'm not doing face cam for these. See, computer just cooled down. Now you don't have to hear the fan so much. You can hear the little fan though. All right, so just wait. This takes a while. Depends on how fast your computer is. Mine's probably on maybe one half of a gigabyte of RAM, running on this thing. Hmm. Alright, so anyway, I'm gonna keep on doing this until it's all loaded. Now it's gonna. Now it's going to reload all of them. Now if I had Bandicam still, I'd be able to do 10 minute videos, but I don't kinda. If I wanna do something long, I kinda would stick up to OBS. Or I can just. I'm gonna do some research today and find some other. Recorders other than this one because Bandicam demo is actually really useful for these kind of tutorials. And yeah, but this tutorial has been nine, almost ten minutes. All right. So as you can see, you're going to see. It's not going to say 19 mods loaded. It's going to say three mods loaded, three mods active. Those are just the mods I got. So next, find a mod like you want to download. Go to a random site because those are really good. I'm going to download them on. So make sure, actually, close Minecraft. Close Minecraft. But download a mod from a site. Doesn't matter what site. Um, my computer's being sold, but just download one. Say, so, yeah, let's just go. 
Musical scene. We'll play mod. The search of that. And then your Minecraft. Um, that's already one, but I'm just going to just go here. Alright, so find a mod that you like now. Do to do. Ancestors of the of the deep. Now this mod is looks like it's really cool. It's recently uploaded today actually. Terraria buttons mod. Alright, so first of all, it's not gonna take you to a freaking grocery page. Oh my god, it closed the page. Oh, I just download it and drag it out of your downloads folder to here like this. Put it somewhere where you know where it is. Open your not Minecraft folder. After wait, 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 wait. Put your sure R app data percent app data. Percent app data percent. Then find your mod. And this should be really easy. Mod. Put your single Put your mod in there, and I've already showed you that. This is the mod that I do not want to use. Then, after, soon after that, close all your programs and open Minecraft again. Now, this is going to take a while, so I'm going to show you. Something. Guys, I've been trying to root my phone. Like, root it. But my phone is an XT1080, so it's kind of hard to root those. I've been trying to figure it out. I need a USB. So anyway, it's gonna pop up this, like this sort of this this kind of a screen. Yeah, like this. Don't click anything, or it's going to fail. Because like constructing mods. Now this should be way easier because guess what? I didn't put any mods in or out. Um, I was about to put that one in, but it's like, oh uh, no. We could have just taken one out and put it back in, but that would be useless. But, yeah, this might not be the best tutorial ever. I'm just saying, but, guys, I might not get, I might get a lot of views on this, but I might get a lot of hate on this, too. So, if you don't hate this video, please. I've been trying to make videos that make sense, but my computer's so slow. And I really can't do stuff like that. And then, once you do this, you can either full screen it, which I am going to do. And I'm really quick just going to go into my mansion. I call it Xeon's mansion. Because I put it up. I had my friend. I built it. His name is Xeon. And guess what? I had my friend do it. Built the, no, I built it, and I sent the world to my friend, and he uploaded it on maps. Um, I'll find the link to that and paste it in the description. But anyway, that's really all you do for that. Now, it's going to download the terrain. So, that's actually how easy mods doing with forges. But if you guys don't want to download a lot of stuff that's probably not healthy for your computer, then you do not have to do the forward way. Runar is probably the safest, but it's h the hardest way. This is the easiest way. So anyway, you're just gonna download the mod. It would take. A, it's going to take a while to load worlds. Depends really on what kind of stuff you're using. Anyway, you see the point. Anyway, you have your mods because it should say mods like loaded. Um, I'm just going to alt F4 this because this game is not responding. Like, no wonder it's not working. But anyway, guys, um, thank you for watching. And yeah, I already just plugged. Just, just.
But anyway, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. I'm going to upload this video and hopefully get some views, but <sighs> see you next time, guys. Bye.